mga ka-Alien, welcome back to my YouTube channel again. This is Sir DL and welcome to The Aliens Vlog. For today, we are going to have another math tutorial and it's all about addition of polynomials. Our objectives for this lesson, number one, discuss addition of polynomials. Number two, identify the rules in adding polynomials. And number three, solve additions of addition of polynomials. Always remember to delight yourself in the Lord and He will give you the desires of your heart. Always remember to delight yourself in the Lord and He will give you the desires of your heart. Let's start to have a practice. Addition of polynomials, 2x cubed minus 4x squared minus 6x plus 6x cubed plus 9x squared plus 9x. What is the process in adding polynomials? Number one, align and combine all similar terms. We need to align and combine all similar terms. We will be looking for the for the terms which has the same variable and same exponent. For example, this one we will be aligning. We will be aligning x cubed, x cubed, then x squared, then x squared, x, x. Align and combine, then we will be following the rules in addition of integers. What is 2x cubed plus 6x cubed? That is 8x cubed. Very good. Negative 4x squared plus 9x squared. We have the similar sign. That's why we are going to subtract. Then follow the higher in terms of absolute value. Follow the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. That is 5x squared. Very good. We also have the similar sign for negative 6 and 9x. So we will be subtracting. Then follow the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. Negative 6x plus 9x. That is 3x. So the answer for this problem will be x 8x cubed plus 5x squared plus 3x. The first step, align and combine all similar terms. Number two, follow, follow the rules in addition of integers. Next example, negative 7x cubed minus 5x squared plus 4 plus 8x cubed plus 2x squared plus 3x. Again, align and combine all similar terms. That is negative 7x cubed, negative 5x squared. We don't have value for x. That's why I put a space, then plus 4. On this part, we have 8x cubed plus 2x squared. Since we have the value for x, we will be aligning on this part. Then no, we will be putting a space on this part because there's no constant for this example. Then we will be proceeding to addition and follow the rules in addition of integers. Negative 7x cubed plus 8x cubed, that is x cubed because negative 7 plus 8 is x or 1, 1x one cubed. Negative 5x squared plus 2x squared, that is, we have the similar sign, so we will be subtracting it, then follow the higher in terms of, follow the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. The answer will be negative 3x squared. Then we don't have something to add on this part, bring it down, bring it down. So the final answer is x cubed minus 3x squared plus 3x plus 4. That is the sum of negative 7x cubed minus 5x squared plus 4 plus 8x cubed plus 2x squared plus 3x. Next one, negative 10x cubed minus 11x squared minus 3x plus 6 plus negative 20x4 minus 2x squared plus 3x cubed minus 6. Again, our first step, align and combine all similar terms, just like this one. So I put a space on this part because there's no value for um, x4 on this part, x raised to 4. I put a space on this part because there's no value for x. So we will be proceeding to the rules in addition. We have negative 20x4, x raised to 4, we will be bringing it down because there's no something to add. On this part, negative 10x cubed plus 3x cubed, we have the similar sign. We will be subtracting them, then follow the sign of the higher absolute value. The answer will be negative 7x cubed. Next one, we have the same sign. So we add, then follow the sign. Negative 11 plus negative 2, that is negative 13x squared. Bring down negative 3x, then 6 plus negative 6, adding a number and its opposite is always equal to 0. So our final answer will be, Negative 20x4 minus 7x cubed minus 13x squared minus 3x. Another example for this part. 15x raised to 4 minus 11x squared minus 12x plus 2 plus negative 23x4 plus 18x squared plus 3x minus 14. Align and combine all similar terms. We will be aligning them. 
we have x raised to 4, x raised to 4, x squared, x squared, x, x, then constant. Then we will be proceeding to the rules in addition. 15x4 plus negative 23, x raised to 4. We have the similar sign, so we will be subtracting these two. Then proceed. Then we will be following the higher, the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. So 15 plus negative 23, that is negative 8x raised to 4. 11 plus negative 11 plus 18. We also have the similar sign. The answer will be plus 7x squared. Very good. Negative 12x plus 3x. We don't have. We we have the similar sign again. Subtract. Then follow the higher in terms of absolute value. Follow the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. So we have negative 9x. 2 plus negative 14. The answer will be negative 12. Our final answer will be negative 8x raised to 4 plus 7x squared minus x minus 12. Next example, x cubed minus 5x squared plus 6x minus 10 plus negative 7x4 plus 4x cubed minus 3x plus 4. We align and combine all similar terms. So we will be aligning them like this one. A spacer because there's no x value for x squared on this part. Then there's no value for x raised to 4 on, the ne on this add -in. So we will be following the rules in addition of integers. So we'll bring this one down. Then 1 plus 4, that is 5x cubed. Bring, that, bring this one down. 6 plus negative 3x. That is positive 3 because we will be subtracting it. Then follow the sign of the higher in terms of absolute value. Negative 10 plus 4. The answer is negative 6. So our, our final answer will be negative 7x raised to 4 plus 5x cubed minus 5x squared plus 3x minus 6. That will be the rules in terms of addition of polynomials. Okay, we're finished. It's very easy, right? We to add polynomials, align and combine all similar terms, then follow the rules in terms of addition of integers. Always remember to be excellent of what is good and be innocent of evil. This is Sir DL telling you, thank you for watching and God bless you. God loves you. Always remember that. Bye!